So everybody that everybody that came against me in my house a long time ago, it should it's been about 20 years where a bunch of people tried to mess with me. And uh you know, a prophet's not known in his own hometown, right? So these were flesh creatures. These were these were these were religious flesh creatures and some of them were just witches and warlocks and some of them were just flat out brute beasts, you know. And so about 20 years later, they should be getting, they should be reaping what they sow because when you go against God's elect, I didn't, I didn't ask for, I didn't try to get revenge on any of them. When you both, I just let God handle it. And when you so when you go against God's elect, there always is a backlash. I didn't try to get revenge. Uh, one whole family just they were. I heard through the grapevine. Somebody said, "Did you hear of such and such died?" No, I didn't know. She, I didn't know he died. Did you know his that mama died? No, I didn't know his. Mom. Did you know his daddy died? No, I didn't know his daddy died. I didn't know because I don't care. God, it's in God's hands. Have you checked on your ex? No, I don't. I don't know what she's doing. I don't care. But I know God has re repaid. Uh, if you reap what you sow, and God is not a respecter of persons, I know for a fact they've reaped what they sowed. It's been twenty years there, and so I, what, the reason is I thought about this today is because a lot of people, there's stuff that happens to them. And they are sitting there saying, why me, God? Why me? But they don't remember what they did. <laughs> they don't remember what they did way back then, you know, way back when. It's a trip. One of the reasons I'm putting these poles and building a bunch of fences, I've got to cut these trees down. That's going to be a job. One reason I'm building these fences is because... Uh, that pole represents uprightness. Steady, upright, steady state. And when you when you come into a when you go into a building, any kind of building, an entrance of any kind, you see poles. That represents a type and a shadow of standing firm, upright fighting fighting the battles stand therefore having your loins girt about with truth fighting against all the liars and all the con artists and all the jezebels and all the narcissists and all the psychopaths and all the brute beasts and all the liars and all the people who attack i cannot imagine uh that there's not a uh a, a hit back has to be when they come at you and your focus is on God God's will learning more about God and that's all you that's really just your your life path and they come against that to try to pull you into their junk and their drama there has to be a a spiritual wall that just knocks them back I've actually seen God knock the demons back and so if he knocks the demons back which are have more power than these little clay creatures. I've seen him knock the demons back. And if he can knock the demons back with spiritual realm, he can definitely knock a human back and just knock them down out of your out of your out of your world, out of your sight, out of your ear gate, out of your eye gate. They're just gone. They're not even in your storyline anymore. I know it's happening. And it's not it's not a I will hear I know for a fact it's about time for me to hear such and such. Did you hear what happened to such and such? No, I didn't hear that. It's about that time, though, again. 